So, um, in true heartfeltization storm, um, there is that part on like Saturday that week that like I came back to Fargo. Hopefully the door doesn't just randomly open again. Maybe it had maybe it had a stimuli that I just didn't quite perceive. I mean there were people out there. So anyway. Oh, but here someone comes from the other way. But I picked this area. Um but it's cool it's cool to like do stuff in different areas, get some variety, you know? Even though all you're seeing is, for the most part, is my face, so it's like, but still, look at those leaves. It's a bus station. Look at the pipes. Those are big pipes, right? Look at that light. Watch you not even have been able to see what I was trying to get you to see. Because I couldn't see at the time what was on the screen. Anyway, but um so in true heartfeltization storm um cuz I came back into town because it was someone's last time going out before they move apparently. Um and I I didn't but if I ended up coming back into town um and then the next day um I ended up so that the night that I Came back to Fargo and went dancing and whatnot. One of the bouncers at Bucks was like, "You can if you like." I did like I didn't ask, but like they offered, and so I think that's probably how that was supposed to go. Um, but so Saturday, I ended up being there and like I ended up being there till like seven p.m. and then um, seven something p.m. between like seven and eight, and then I was able to give him a ride back to work. Otherwise, he apparently would have had to walk. So usefulness and stuff. Earlier in the day, I didn't know if it'd be okay for me to use the car of the, like, that the person I was pet sitting for was letting me use. But I asked him, and he responded, but by the time he responded, they had already gone in the morning to where, or, yeah, because I think both of them went, the couple. Um, the bouncer from Bucks and then, like, his wife, I believe they're married, um, but by the time I had heard from the person I was pet sitting for, they had already gone. Um, but then I think I also had asked after that, like ju at some point, just in at some point after asking, um, I asked if like, if there is another scenario that popped up, like if I, it would be okay to use the car. So so when it came to the to the time of like the idea of taking him to work, I was able to do that. And then I ended up taking his uh, wife, too. I didn't ask about two people being in the car to the person I was pet sitting for. But but that Saturday, I was able to watch Hulu. They had Hulu. She had Hulu or they and she let me. Um, and at the house um, where I was pet sitting, it didn't have Hulu. So I watched some Boruto. And Boruto and Sarada end up facing Deepa again. So when I saw that, I wondered, like, what am I going to face? Like, or am I going to... Like, what am I... Like, kind of like, am I going to face something? Or what am I going to face or something? And... So, um, so there's a part in this series, maybe a whole video or part of a whole video, because I felt, um, I felt intimidated by the girl that this series is, is pretty much about. And after True Heartfeltization Storm, this series that I did last week, that's a hundred videos long. I did a hundred videos in, in, hello. Have a good day. Um, 
I did 100 videos in about a week's time. It was 10 videos, then 16, then 15, then 15, then 14, then 16, then 13, I think. Um, so I ended up breaking in my record for most videos in a day that I haven't beaten for years, I would think. Um, I would think beat my record for most videos in a week. Um, excuse me. And if we're going from Monday to Sunday, it might not be 100, but it's it should still, I don't know exactly what it would be, but maybe somewhere between 90 and 100, I'd guess. Guesstimate. Um, and... You know, now that I think about it, I probably should be able to beat my record for a month because last year during Ramadan, it was like 130 something. I just did about 100 in a week. So unless I'm miscalculating something this time around of thinking about it, like that, that shouldn't even be a question, really. Why was I? Why was I? I feel like I thought about this in the past and didn't like get to this like place where it's like yeah I'm, i definitely beat that so i don't know why i didn't because i thought i was thinking about like records for like if i would have beat the day one the the week one the month one stuff like that like i thought about this before but it, it didn't click the way it is now but like if i did a hundred in seven days in October, and there's all these other days in October, and yes, every other day I'm not doing like every other day. Then that then last week I'm not doing like 16 videos a day, but like I I make videos, so I may this this month I may have beat all of those day, week, and month potentially. Maybe I'm wrong, but um, so. so so at some point, um, maybe in the last days of the week or maybe yesterday, Monday, at some point I came like towards the end of this week process or yeah, towards the end of this like week focus period process, I happened across um, the heartfelt girl, whatever number in the series it is that's called I Feel Intimidated and with like what was going on in True Health Feltization Storm. Maybe I was like pretty much done with the series or close or something. I, um, like when I saw that, I like, <laughs> was like, what? Like, like there's a lot that that's happened in this, in this uh, True Heart Feltization Storm series. Like the bug that I have, like normally in this channel where like I keep feeling like I have to push on openness and I keep feeling this push. Like I feel like, kind of um, relieved of that um, or it's kind of like resting some or it's kind of like at peace a little bit more. It's not, or it's like calm down some. Yeah, that might be the way that I want to put it. Um, so like, I accomplished something in true heart feltization storm. Um, so towards the end of that video series or whatnot, or maybe like after, like I wouldn't have made the hundredth video yet because I made the hundredth video in Fargo, um, in the library. And then, so it's probably, maybe it was somewhere in the night, like in the nineties, maybe it was Sunday. I don't know, but it was in probably somewhere between the latter videos or something like that, that like I happened across that true or no, that, uh, heartfelt girl, um, like video that's like, I feel intimidated and I like kind of like, like <laughs> what, or like something, like some kind of reaction to that that was like, like, I don't know, like almost I can't relate or like what, or like, and that's just a week later. So I felt, so when I talked about that, there's things that I wanted to talk about in the last video for True Heartfelt Edition Storm that I didn't, didn't get to. And that I would be able to talk about them in other series. And the Heartfelt Girl was one of the series. I think what I was going to say, like, would I would think would be that, like, 
I don't, I don't know, maybe something about Buses not. will be departing in two minutes. Maybe something about not being intimidated, I would have thought. Um, like, I, I don't know what else necessarily I would want to talk about for the Heartful Girl series in relation to, like, the last video in that series or, or whatnot. But today, um, so there had been something on her wall that I've responded to, that I commented on like a few days ago. Um, and she hadn't responded, so maybe I thought she just wasn't responding. And, like, even before not responding to that comment, like, I thought that maybe she was, I, I would think, I probably thought, like, she was, like, maybe like maybe upset with me or, like, kind of stuff. Um, there's just kind of a way that you kind of, at least for me, that I've, like, there's, there's a lot of. Uh, will be departing in one minute. This is the final call for boarding. In my experience, like, girls can be very, like, just drop off the, like, and there's, there's a way that I'm accustomed to that isn't necessarily how it should be, but, um, but then also girls go through stuff in their life, but so do guys, so, but, um, so, so she hadn't responded to that last last thing that I said, and so I maybe just thought she wasn't responding on purpose or something. But today she respond she like hearted it or something and responded to it, and then liked something else that I had shared in relation to her stuff, like um, in like however long ago, and then she like messaged back on like Messenger and like, and it's not even like she's like just okay with me, like she's like. Please make any transfers quickly. Buses are departing. So, like, we're, so, it's not even just, like, like, neutral, like, there's some, um, like, okayness there, or, like, goodness, or if, like, even if a little bit or something, like, there's, there's, so, like, I think what happened was with being, because I was starting to get, because like in as far as like, like, because I, I I gave her like a long message um, after she messaged me, but like, and I I mentioned fangirling in that message too, but like as far as like just the like how touched I was and just how like affected and like sharing of her stuff and all that. Like I began, I began to feel like uh, off feeling doing that. Like I didn't know if she, like if maybe she didn't like me sharing her Facebook stories. Um, I wanted to put like in my bio, like right now I have something about the movie Show of the Father and then how like God, like I struggled with that movie and then God took care of me the next day. Like I think right now it's like something like Show Me the Father in theaters now or something had me messed up, but then God took care of me the next day, something like that. And then I wanted to put like something about her or like maybe Jordan smiles or her or something like that. And, but I was scared too because, and like, just because there's that concern of like, like blowing her stuff up too much and stuff like that. Um, so I think because, and then I, and then I also ended up feeling intimidated by her. So that, that was an aspect too. one, either, either being intimidated by her or the, not knowing if I could like be as active or like how like if like not being uncomfortable or unsure of like if I could like like how she might react to stuff. Um, so one or both of those things: uncertainty with how she might feel with my actions, or uncertainty with like if I were to sh- like me sharing stuff or me blowing up or stuff. Uncertainty roughly in relation to that stuff, and then. May and and or so that and or being intimidated by like a new dynamic that I saw in one of her videos, like that, di- like sh- 